people will deny it, but I'm the one that started the goddamn club. I mean, I just said that this should be a club, right? You know, the 001 Losers Club. That should be a club. Ian first, myself second, and Zippy third got our tattoos by Penelope with uh, just the, like, the, the way they did it in the jail. Did I really give them to five guys? You know, this is kind of crazy, but I gave a lot of tattoos back then. But, and generally, the, the people that were getting the tattoos were fairly drunk. And I think I was also somewhat drunk because I actually don't remember these tattoos. Zero, zero, 001 Losers Club. It's not like, oh, we're a club of this. We're a bunch of losers. 40% of all of our shows were at the Mabuja. So yeah. it was really a home base for us. Yeah. And so many bands played their first show there. And it was just, uh, you just went there. If you weren't playing, you'd go there just to hang out or yeah. you know, just to be there. It was this is the cradle. The core. It was a, a Filipino dinner club. And then at 11 o'clock, they cleared out and all the punks came in. And whatever band, everyone came in, it lasted to 2 in the morning. So 2 in the morning, I mean, I, I remember so well, all the lights went on. and The place is a mess. And there Dirk is up at the front of the stage telling, like, back to the gutter, you slime. <laughs> Get out of my place now. <laughs> and he would sit up there and he, with his little dog and he'd just sit there and talk and say these things. And we just, it was totally outrageous, but it was, we loved it.